Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today I'm going to show you a quick fix for a common annoyance in Marvel Rivals. The long wait time while the game compiles shaders on startup. If you've ever launched the game only to be stuck for 3 to 5 minutes waiting for everything to load, you know how frustrating it can be. The reason behind this delay is that Marvel Rivals, which is built on UE5, compiles shaders using your CPU instead of your GPU. This design decision, for reasons that aren't entirely clear, tends to slow things down, especially when you're in the middle of a gaming session and need to restart your game due to crashes or any other hiccup. I used to face this issue every time I launched the game until a friend of mine accidentally discovered a workaround. He had modified some settings on my system that ended up messing with the compatibility mode for the launcher. All it took was for him to go into the properties of the launcher.exe and uncheck the run in compatibility mode option. Once that was done, my shaders started loading quickly again, and I no longer had to wait minutes before the game kicked off. Now, if you're still experiencing delays even after that fix, there's another potential solution you might want to try. Marvel Rivals shader compilation can be influenced by your system settings, particularly a feature in Windows known as Hardware Accelerated GPU Scheduling. While this feature is designed to improve performance in certain games, it appears to cause issues with Marvel Rivals by making the shader compilation process even more unpredictable. I found that disabling this feature has made a noticeable difference. To do that, you'll need to search for Game Mode in your Windows settings, locate the Hardware Accelerated GPU Scheduling toggle, and disable it. Also, it might be helpful to reset the GPU shader settings. There's a guide on the Marvel Rivals website that walks you through the steps, which has worked perfectly for me. I hope this tip helps you get back to enjoying Marvel Rivals without those annoying startup delays. If you run into any issues or have other fixes, let me know in the comments below. Thanks for watching and happy gaming!